Well, welcome back to Good Day, and it's a good day when you can honor businesses that have stood the test of time, like one of Ohio's oldest general stores. Yeah, this is a big deal. That would be Beakers in Pemberville. Todd Cheats is keeping an eye on this Northwest Ohio gem. Good morning. Thanks for joining us today. Good morning. Okay, so tell us the history of this store. It's a pretty old store. It is. It's 146 years old. It's always been a general store. Uh, we are one of Ohio's oldest general stores. Uh, it has been in continuous operation and it actually became Beaker's in 1924 when Fred Beaker uh, became the sole proprietor. Yeah, so. Uh, 146 years, Todd, so uh, that's a lot of history. Can you uh, show us around the store just a little bit? What are uh, some of the things that take you back to the past? We, we certainly can. Um, the general store is very much like it was 146 years ago. Uh, we still have the old ribbon case, the pool case, um, the counters are all original, the brass cash register. Um, so it's uh, like taking a step back in time and we have a photo that's dated 102 years here in the store and it's fun for folks to uh, take a look at that photo and then see uh, all of those same fixtures and all of those pieces of history that are still in place here at Beakers. Very cool. I imagine that customers come in and they see something uh, that really, um, you know, speaks to them. What is it? What is it like for you as the owner there to engage with these customers who are experiencing this? It's fun. When they walk in, I had a, a patron uh, just Sunday that walked in and said, wow, uh, if they've never been here, it is certainly a step back in time. Uh, kind of fun to see some of the products that would have been or reproduction products that would have been uh, here in the general store over the many years. Uh, so it's fun as they find those keepsakes and those treasures. We have lots of unique things from local artisans and crafters, uh, just like the store would have had way back when. Uh, so it's fun. It's a, it's a real uh, fun experience to wait on those customers and um, find them, help them find that special item here in the general store. Yeah, that's really cool. And uh, I was just in Pemberville this past weekend, and Pemberville's a nice, quaint yes. little town, mm -hmm. uh, really cute. And uh, just hearing our photographer walk around, you can hear that old wood. So is that wood uh, pretty much original as well? It is. The floor is original and of course it talks to us. It creaks <laughs> as you walk on it. Uh, of course we have a magnificent tin ceiling which is kind of unique. Um, all of the light fixtures, um, everything here in the store uh, is original and we are very fortunate because buildings to our west uh, that were identical to this building were destroyed by fire. So we are very oh. fortunate that this building still stands um, and we are proud to welcome folks through the double doors here at Beakers. Uh, Todd, what made you say, I want to buy this store? <laughs> You want to buy this store? <laughs> no, what made you say that you wanted to buy it when oh. you did, you know, a few years back? Oh. <laughs> I'm sorry, thank you. Um, I have always loved, I have always loved history and at the age of 12 I started helping here in the general store, Miss Speaker, the previous owner. Um, I would come in after school and just always had a love for history and of course like small town life, like Pemberville and so felt it was my duty to kind of continue the tradition here at Beakers. <laughs> He's been doing it since he was 12. 12 years old. I don't think I'm going to buy it from you, Todd. I think you're doing a great job there. <laughs> <laughs> well, well, thank you, but we, we could always talk. <laughs> <laughs> he's a, he's a businessman, Amanda, is, so is. yeah, he'll honor a nice uh, price. So when, what are your hours so people can stop out and see you? We are here now seven days a week until Christmas, except for Thanksgiving Day. Uh, we are here Monday through Saturday from 9 to 5.30, Sundays 12 to 4. And this weekend, we have our big open house festival here in Pemberville, so we invite folks to come see us. Oh, that'll be a good opportunity to come out and check things out. Yeah, absolutely. Well, we thank you so much for joining us this morning. <laughs> All right, thank you. Come see us. Yes, yeah, sounds fun. Take care. Well, we still got.
a lot more to come here on Good Day. Yeah, so uh, folks will be celebrating Halloween in just two weeks. How the Toledo Zoo is getting ready uh, for that day. The wit, some fun <laughs> for the kids. We'll be right back.